Hi. Oh, hey. Sorry. No, I was just I was just prepping. I was prepping your eulogy. Um, ah! Oh. Did I make that joke last time? I hope so. Hi, my name is Gabe Hicks, and today I have four delightful future coffins with me, and we're going to be playing through the Dark Souls role-playing game. It's going to get weird, it's going to get a little strange, and we get to watch them die over and over and over and over and over and over and over times eight again for our entertainment and it's usually not permanent unless someone rolls a specific number on one of the charts but that's besides the point i have here with me a lovely quadro i don't know words are hard and i'm going quartet. to go around the table Baba quartet, yeah oh <laughs> yeah we're Thanks. gonna start singing <laughs> <laughs> i didn't nope. sign up for that now you have to go first ej please introduce right. yourself Hi everyone, I'm EJ, I'm That's One Big Egg in chat, and I'm Several Big Eggs on Twitter, and I'm not Gosh. here to sing today. That will never stop confusing me. <laughs> it's, dude, it's a good name, it's a good name. It is. You'll never forget it. It's unforgettable. There you go, yeah. Drax, he gets it. <laughs> <laughs> Drax, since you get it, please introduce it. <laughs> Um, I've actually been using this in every introduction since last week. Hi, and the lone Draconics. Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> even though technically I'm not lone anymore since Bravo is right beneath my screen. Um, but I'm Draconics, and he, they pronouns. Um, you can find me on Twitch. I don't know if it's Twitch. I suppose you can find me on Twitch. Yeah, Draconics. But mainly on Twitter, Draconics. That's D-R-A-K-O-N-I-Q-E-S. Um, I'm playing the Everlasting Stitches. Or he uses he, they pronouns. Um, I'm also not here to sing for you. Damn it, maybe next yeah, time. Okay. <laughs> Eric, please. Hello, everyone. I'm Eric. Uh, you, I, today I am playing Monty Boyd, and I and no one dies today. That's my promise. N we're, we're gonna beat. Promise? We're gonna beat all the things, and no one's gonna die. And Gabe's gonna be like, I, I uh, shoot. I trust <laughs> this guy. I trust Just this on. guy. Oh I mean, man. Insane. Oh, gee willikers, I can't believe they, they outfoxed me again. Yeah. Darn. Rats. <laughs> you got Darn. me. Not drats. <laughs> you got me. <laughs> and look, we have the wonderful returning Bravo. <gasps> My name's so fancy when you say it. Hi, guys, I'm Bravo. Uh, I'm playing uh, Meliora. She's a sorceress. Um, I'm very excited to get her on the field and have her not die a horrible death. Um, I've grown a little attached to her as I've thought about her in my brain. Um, so we're going to see how that turns out. Um, but I'm sure we'll be fine. Ooh, what a mistake. So ah! last time we left, the party had just arrived at a new bonfire. But in true Dark Souls fashion, before resting at the bonfire, one of them made the choice to activate a summoning sign. Didn't even look at what color it was. Let's okay. look at what color it was. It was red. Ah! <laughs> so red for love. We get a friend. Yes. <laughs> Maybe get a romanceable NPC. Uh, hey, yes. <laughs> the way that they romance you is by driving a sword through your chest. Look, a figure. Not the worst way. <laughs> Hey, been a long pandemic, honestly. Look, um, if <laughs> I die, I die. <laughs> it's been a while since I've been impaled, so, you know. Look, I'm glad we all have the same taste. <laughs> yep, you know what? All right, I felt bad before. I don't feel bad anymore. <laughs> a red, almost ethereal figure rises up from the ground with a long blade in hand and a sword. Now, before we get into this, we're going to go through a few things just of import for combat. Number one is the bloodied condition. The bloodied condition activates when a character is at half of their base position. So, excuse me, half of their starting position. Starting. So when you are at half of your starting position, let's say that your starting position is, hmm, da, 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 da. For, yes, for example, a player character with a starting position pool of 50 becomes bloodied when they are down to 25. Mm -hmm. So when you become bloodied, that is when you will get your bloodied bonuses due to your character choices. 
that is important. Some creatures also do get bloodied conditioned bonuses. Uh. We'll see if this is one of them or not. Secondly is initiative. Many creatures have a predetermined initiative, but there are a few exceptions that just have an initiative that is they always go first. You're fortunate that this isn't one of them. If you roll higher than the creature's initiative DC, then you're considered fast and you will go before them. And you can go before them in any order if multiples of you are fast. If you roll under the creature's initiative DC, then you are considered slow and you will be going after the creature acts. And any of you can go in whatever order you would like in that sense as well. Then the last thing is your positioning. And when you roll combat, a during combat, characters will increase their position by rolling a number of position dice, which is determined by your origin, and they generate additional temporary position. Now that is additional temporary position, so that does not attribute to the bloodied status. Mm. If your base position, if your starting position is 15, and it goes up to 30, for example, because of the additional bonus, bloodied is not at 15, bloodied would then be at like seven. Does that all make sense? Mm-hmm. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. I'm going to need a reminder when that happens, but <laughs> so, it makes so, sense for now. A, a prime example. Uh, EJ, what is, what is your current, like, what is your base position currently? 13. 13. So we will say if you're at six or under, that's when you are bloodied. Let me write that down. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Absolutely. And so, well, Jack, what is, what is your base position? Mine's 12. 12? So six? Yeah. Uh, Eric, what is yours? 14. 14, so Ooh, seven. Big boy. And uh, Bravo, I think we were leveling you up. So what was your original position at level one? Seven. Seven. So then your new base position is going to be your con mod. What's that? Zero. Zero. And, and plus your new level. So a level of two. So it's going up by two. So your new base is now a nine. Ooh. So we will say that you are bloodied at four or under. You got it. Beautiful. All right. That's less good than I was hoping for, because my bloody yeah. thing is plus two to AC and dexterity. And if I have to wait to be seven. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's my goal. Ah. Now, the other thing that's very important tonight for all of you joining us, we are doing a special giveaway. Mention it in chat. Exclamation point giveaway, which will link you to the raffle. There is plenty of things going on. The collector's edition book is beautiful, shiny, and just as hefty. But look at those beautiful gold pages. So pretty. Ooh. It really is. I'm going to cuddle it today. <laughs> <laughs> It'll give I'm me like... reassurance if I kill anybody here. Oh, no. <laughs> so, uh... <laughs> Bravo. You are, what is your character's name once more? Meliora. Meliora, that's right. Meliora, you feel something calling to you and you are unaware of where you are. You're almost in a void, in a different plane of existence. You find yourself, Dark Souls doesn't do this, but we're making it the rules. You find yourself pulled somewhere else, standing next to a bonfire, resting, Almost like you're in a different plane of existence. You see your three companions and you see a strange ethereal foe before him. So I'm going to give you the opportunity to watch your friends live or die. Uh, sounds good to me. Cool. I'll I just wanted to puff my skirt out just like. I love this. This is why I love the Dark Souls world. So, uh, Zach, Stitches, Monty. Let's go ahead and roll initiative. Oh boy, okay. Oh, I, I mean, that makes sense. I hate rolling that twenties <laughs> for initiative. <laughs> Save those for combat, EJ. I know. I rolled a four. Meliora pulls out a piece of jerky from the pockets in her dress and is just eating it and watching. <laughs> So nat 20 for it with EJ for a total of what? 22. Beautiful. Just wanted to know. Uh, Drac for a four. 
Yeah. And Eric for an eleven. Eleven. Ooh, lovely. So Zach is fast. Stitches and Monty will be slow. So go ahead, Zach. You see this figure rise, a silver knight, a knight clad in perfect unmarred silver armor. Maybe I shouldn't have summoned this. Does it um, obviously look aggressive? Yes. <laughs> okay, okay. That's a good thing. I'm glad that you said that. Otherwise, whew. Okay, uh, yeah, in that case, Zach is gonna, like, kind of, like, bound over on all fours and kind of slide underneath Stitch's legs and start clubbing at the shins of this, <laughs> this spectral figure. Do we roll uh, position now? Yes, you do. Oh, yeah. Okay. I forgot to do I was that. Like, I was like, I don't, I want to have my position back before yep. I start getting No, you, you, you roll your additional position right at the beginning of initiative, but since this is a learn to play, I'll be honest, I was going to see if anyone actually did it or not. Oh, I just did it. I didn't. I didn't know we had to say you. it out loud. Um, Please keep saying no, it. No, that's fine. Please keep saying it. <laughs> this, okay, I okay. keep saying it out loud. Uh, I got a twenty. Eric to might hit. have just saved your lives. <laughs> Rules. Very cleric of you, Eric. Twenty to hit. Does that hit? <laughs> so. You swing ah. your club down onto this creature, and they block it with their shield. Oh. And move your blow to the side. Is there... <laughs> oh, so we're fucked. Okay. Oh, hi. <laughs> oh, God. We actually... Hold on. The, I... <laughs> All Zach does is hit with this stick. <laughs> There's nothing else I can do. Oh, okay, yeah. My. Seeing that, I kind of... Um... <laughs> Yeah, that's my turn. <laughs> so this this Ooh, isn't necessarily this all guy. bad. The in very Dark Souls fashion, after defect deflecting your blow, they put their shield on their back and then two hand the sword in their hand. <laughs> God damn it. Let me add this position so uh <laughs> 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 okay. calculator out. <laughs> All right, I'm ready. Hit me. Oh, God. Hit me. Nah, I'm oh, not going to do on this that position. just yet. I'm ready. I'm not going to do that just yet. Unless. Um, so that is a 14 to hit. No, it doesn't. <laughs> I'm wearing prayer robes. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> I got clothes. <laughs> so they bring the blade down and swing wide as you roll out of the way. Sadly, it does get two attacks. So I'm going to roll my second one. There's the big yeah, robes on such a little guy, so it's hard to hit. That's yeah. fair. Yeah. Uh, You're hitting second, with loose fabric. Second strike horizontally for a nine is going to miss. Hell yeah. I just like flatten myself into the robes. It just looks like a pool of fabric. You can't see All right. me. <laughs> uh, and then it's actually going to provoke an attack of opportunity because it's moving directly towards Monty and Stitches. Oh. Let's go ahead and make that attack of opportunity. Uh, Zach. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. 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 It's, um, 21 to hit this time. That hits. Yes. Gamer. Okay. I do so much damage. And I drop my D4. That's <laughs> a four to hit. Or no, that's a four damage. Four damage. Four damage? It dies, right? It's down. <laughs> uh, you might die a little bit inside, but <laughs> it takes the four damage and then keeps on trucking. Really? Perfect. Even though it's bloodied now? Oh. Even though it's definitely <laughs> bloodied, right? Definitely. Uh, I think I probably broke its leg right there. That was a That is a right premonition of your blood. Sorry. Uh, now it is uh, Monty's turn. Okay, this thing's coming at me. Uh, I guess, I mean, I got a mace. I might as well smack with it. I'm going to try that. Uh, is it within melee of us now, or is it like approaching melee? It's in melee of you now. Okay. Yeah. Then I, uh, let's see, what am I adding? I add to Plus one to hit. So 16 to hit. Uh, that will miss. Unfortunately, 
So I'll just deflect off some armor. All right. And then stitches. Um, I'm going to take the disengage action and run. Um, <laughs> 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 oh shit, fuck, fuck. And just like just scrambles on his ass, scrambles Harry. backwards, and then <laughs> hurries away, takes a full 30 feet of movement to stay away from this. Hey, I, it was an accident. I thought it was a core symbol. Didn't realize to bring you here. Really apologize. Um, yeah, just 30 feet distance, please. Um, I've got a bad cold. You can tell Zag is now charging <laughs> both stitches and the, the summon. <laughs> uh, so as you run a bit into the distance stitches, you see another summoning sign, but this one is golden. Oh. So you can use that on your next turn, if you would like. Oh, have I learned my lesson, or am I going <laughs> to test my luck again? We'll We're going to bring it back to Zach. Uh, I'm not in melee range of the summit anymore, right? But I'm within, like, running distance, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. you can be okay, okay. in the next move. Okay, okay, cool. I am going to over to the summon um and then i'm gonna hit it with my stick again because that's what zach's good at yep, go ahead uh, that is a 23 to hit yep three damage Ooh, fierce <laughs> you know what? death by a thousand little paper cuts you don't want to hit so far you're doing better than literally everyone else in his encounter <laughs> Oh, oh, wait. Boy, okay, dope. Uh, so now you are both within melee range. Mm -hmm. Where's where's that thing? Where's that thing I wanted? Whatever it is, it's not there. I don't think it's there. I think you use not bonus there. action kill and just kill it with my bonus action. Bonus action <laughs> kill! Yeah, just a bonus action finger of death or something. You know? <laughs> mm -hmm. Where, bonus I definitely action read speed that run, it hit right? two people do at once. Where is that? What do I have to roll to clip through the environment? <laughs> <laughs> eh, I can't find it fast enough. So you'll be. Oh, there it is. No. Spend three position. <laughs> the Silver Knight may attack, may target two creatures instead of one using an attack with its sword or its spear. A sweeping strike. So I'm going to spend three position and then I'm going to use a sweeping strike since both Zach and Monty are in melee range. Oh, that's a nine. Oh, man. Ain't that the thing about it. I'm going to spend three position again on its second attack. And it's going to work this time. You will try. To remind of everyone, um, actually, wait, I want to wait until Gabe is finished. That's a nine again for the third time. <laughs> Okay, reminder, remember you can spend positions to bump you, your roll up by one per position. So if you miss, remember that. Dude! Come on! <laughs> Don't tell Gabe! <laughs> yeah, just spend, I think you need like, how, how much position does this guy have left? Like 30? I think you need to spend like 30. Yeah, spend the seven right position yeah, to yeah, hit yeah, us yeah, twice. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. It's a learn to play, and even the... Yeah. I, I wanted to help people learn. I'm willing to spend seven position to make that attack hit. Oh no, <laughs> I'm so sorry. Do, yeah. You know what, do it, because sweeping oh, attack crap. sounds a lot like slashing damage, and I got this cool new outfit. You know oh, what, no, no, I'm going to gamble. Fine. I'm going to, I'm going to, because I rolled a nine, I'm going to spend, I'm going to spend eight position, because I don't remember what your ACs are, so that'll bring it up to... Whatever math is. Nine, 17. eight, 17. seventeen. Thank you. So seven will seventeen hit both of you? Yeah. Um it's a great thing that this armor is resistant to slashing damage, correct? Uh, correct. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, just, I can't get over how cheeky EJ is with this new armor. <laughs> I got I'm really rare. It's Zach's first clothes. Yeah, Zach's never had clothes before. Nick yeah, he's feeding he himself. Creature. I love it. So... Harry Potter gave Dobby a sock. <laughs> <laughs> Prayer ropes. Prayer ropes. <laughs> oh, God. Can't wait till We're Zach finds a helmet. Oh, they're going to go crazy. Okay. Go crazy. Hmm. 
So you're going to take half damage, right? Mm -hmm. From slashing? Mm -hmm. Okay. So you will take 13 points of slashing damage then. Ooh, that's kind of a lot. That's <laughs> <laughs> actually, yeah. Can it be I less than that? I thought it'd be less than that. Yeah, yeah. Well, it, it, was, than that? it was supposed to be 27, but the oh. stuff that I gave you halved it, so. Oh, fuck. Mm. Okay. Yeah, that oh. was, that was, it was a, it was, it was an, it was an average roll. See why, um, Stitch is a coward now? Uh, she should run mm. away. Ah, all right. Oh, that's good. And now it is, uh, Monty's turn. Okay. Um, <laughs> I mean, this little guy's the only one who's been effective. Uh, <laughs> so, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna heal this little guy. Or yes. I'm gonna cast my heal for a uh, grand total. Oh, you're gonna love this three position. <laughs> Ooh, I'll take it, baby. Hell yeah. Spinning strong. Loads of health. Don't even worry about it. Are you gonna move? Are you gonna stay there? What are you, what are you thinking? What are you uh, I mean, if I run away, it's gonna swing at me. So I'm just gonna hope that you continue to roll nines. That's fair. <laughs> Ooh, let's That's flank fair. it. One in the front, one in the back. That way it can't hit us both. That's how it works, right, Gabe? We'll find out. Uh, Stitches, <laughs> what are you doing? Um, now that I'm, I've got a distance away from me. From and I, I, will, I would let you activate the circle as a bonus action if you would like. Ooh, okay then. Uh, hey guys, I know you're all like fighting one of the things I summoned last time, but there's one that's gold, and I think it might be better this time. Gold I literally doing... can't hear you. I'm just like, ah! no. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't say anything, so I'm gonna say this. What the hell answer, is this like big a... I want? No, oh, okay, <laughs> I'm just gonna do it. <laughs> summon, I use my bonus action to summon to use a summon sign. So, this isn't how it normally works in Dark Souls, but I don't care because it's more fun this way. Yeah, as you activate this light. Bravo, you feel the light in your body start to shine. And oh. then a familiar oh. face appears next to you, Stitches. Could you describe oh. your character one more time for us, Bravo? Um, sure. Uh, Meliora, she's um, a woman with kind of wild black hair and kind of just a, just a kiss of a crazed look in her eye. Um, okay. Looks a little tired in the face. Um, wearing a kind of a sorceress's garb. Um, she's got bright orange eyes um, and a cheeky little smile. Oh, it's it's you. Um, well, we're fighting someone. <laughs> uh, I will, I summon someone beforehand and they are currently, I think I've beaten the shit out of Zach. Well, why'd you do that? Um, honestly, I'm not entirely sure. A lapse in judgment. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, it looks it looks rough. There I'm gonna keep is. running this way, and then I'm gonna like. Why are you running from... that way when you should be running that way? Oh, because I can attack like, from down there, um, and they can't hit me from down there. You know, it's kind of oh. like. Yeah. Hey, I'm gonna start backing away now. <laughs> right, right, right. So you I'm gonna want run me to do step. something? Is that why you called me here then? To honestly, more mute shield is the better. Um, and I'm gonna run another oh, thirty great. feet. And then from Shield. now the 60 feet distance, I'm going to use, um, what is it called? Fireball. Do I'm going to throw a fireball at them. Let them make a deck <laughs> What's save. What's that called? <laughs> Hell yeah. Make that attack roll. Oh, they have to make a deck save. Oh, that's, oh, that's right. Dang it. Do we all have to make a deck save? It's mm. one creature. I okay. It's, it's not like D and D nice. fireball. Okay. Well, because yeah. because you know, I was like because I also have a magic <laughs> thing, but it's all creatures within twenty feet. So <laughs> <I haven't been laughs> <using> <laughs> that is a six. This is Ooh, miserable. Perfect. I promise that I am not going easy on you on purpose. Uh, max damage. They no one dies tonight. <sighs> Hell yeah! Except see, for the creature. See, I'm way more effective over here. So like, keep it there. And I'll stay here, and I'll be. It'll be great. It'll be great. Right. So, Meliora, it is your turn. Ah! I get to do things. Yes, you um, do. I. Hmm, I'm relatively far from it. Uh, you're about thirty feet from it. Okay. I'm a back up a little bit more. <laughs> stay. Welcome to the wide. coward club. Keep up. Hey now. <laughs> <laughs> Keep a wide berth from it. Um, I 
I'm gonna back up another 30 feet, so I'm 60 feet away. So probably just right next to Stitches. Just, like, watch him back up and then be like, oh, shit, and also back up. Oh, <laughs> um, Your cleric oh, is right next to this. Can I cast Soul Arrow? Absolutely can. <laughs> okay. Let's do this. Please work or else I'll cry. Do, 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 do. Motherfucker. Are you gonna cry? I think I'm gonna. <laughs> <laughs> I got a four. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's true. Soul Arrow doesn't even have an attack roll. It just... Oh, does it just hit? It's just magic I'm... missile. <gasps> yeah. Yeah, you, you okay. oh, well, don't be excited about it. No, I'm so today. excited about it. So yes, you, you create a glowing arrow of magical force, throwing it at a single enemy creature within 120 feet of you. The orb deals 1d6, force, 1D6 plus 3 force damage to its target. You can increase the damage dealt by the orb at a cost of 2 position per plus 1 damage. Mm. Ooh, do I really come out the gate swinging? Hmm. Not saying that to tempt you at all. Okay, I'll spend two position and make it a, a round it up to a six, because it was five. So I'll spend those those two positions. Do you want me to roll my position dice now? Uh, yeah, that'd be great. Okay. Also, that that's not how rounding works, but. Oh, I didn't mean like round up. I meant like throw it up to a six. Why all right. not? It takes mm -hmm. more damage. Uh, and narratively, it didn't take its shield back. But now it does, because now it's bloodied. <gasps> oh, don't, good not, and bad. Good and bad. Don't be excited about that. I'm so excited. Now I get to play the game. <laughs> no one does. Oh, no. Phase two. Uh, and it's it's lack of eyes. The eye slots on the helmet now glow red. It is your turn, Zach. <laughs> That's that's what Zach does immediately. Just that little uh, that little laugh. Oh, I don't think this will hit. Um, does an eighteen hit? Yes, it does. I thought it's DC was a twenty or it's AC. It was when uh, he had a shield. Yep. Oh, big brain. Ooh, max damage six. <laughs> six. Ooh, so strong. All right. It's still pretty decent damage. Now. Uh, this is because this is a learn to play and I'm not just trying to slaughter you over and over again without purpose. Mm -hmm. I would like to ask, do you want to show everyone what ability you picked for your second level? I was going to, I have a question. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> oh, I don't want to be a coward. Can I disengage with it with my, my action surge? <laughs> yeah. Do I want to do that? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> do I want to do huh. that? I just love I the idea. Like, yeah. Monty and Zach are like in the fray. You know what? And, like, get, you get hit and Monty's like, don't worry, kid, you're going to be fine. And then you smack it and run away. <laughs> it got a lot scarier from the last time we hit it. <laughs> No, you're right. I'm just gonna fucking no. Hit it but again. Te technically, you could you could yeah, just again. That was for future reference. That was for future reference. <laughs> <laughs> Not for right now. You know what? I'll hit it again. Yeah, I'll hit it again. Twenty. Also, days. Adventures of Tony. It is a beautiful large. No, Look at I hate that. that. Oh. A hardcover copy. Look at that. I really like I mean, the way this book I feels. I in the giveaway. I don't know if that's allowed, but I did get in there. <laughs> 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 so I don't think anybody else shares that way. You know, uh, four damage. <laughs> What did you? What did you roll? How do How do you know you hit? I rolled a twenty. Sorry. All right, Wait. that's fine. I just wanted it for me. That's fine. I mean, you do hit. <laughs> I didn't mean to give you actual doubt. I'm sorry. No, I can't remember if I rolled a twenty. Now that's what it's. No, I'm, hey, I believe you. Know. You need this. Okay. It's okay. I trust you. Trust you me. need <laughs> this. <laughs> well, yeah, I need this four damage. Uh, you. Uh, uh, I'll, okay. I'll take what I can get. So oh, it is. Goodness. It is their turn. Um, I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> what does that don't mean? Start, don't start your your action like that. No one does um. tonight. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
So. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay. No, no, no. Yeah, all right. I was full of punches. I lied. Um, <laughs> so I am going to use Piercing Strike. So the Silver Knight will spend three position, and it doubles its two hit bonus on a single weapon attack. Uh, and its mm -hmm. bonus is normally a plus five, so it makes it a plus Oh, 10. my God. Oh. Gabriel's a three. Oh. Gabriel's a three right here. Rolls a three to hit. Ooh, that is a 16, so a 26 to hit. Um, I was close. And as it is bloodied, <laughs> it has two-handed strike. The Silver Knight immediately stows their shield and makes two melee attacks, dealing an additional 2d6 on a successful attack. Until the Silver Knight is reduced to zero position, it triggers, it triggers a critical hit on an attack roll of an 18 to 20 and can make a single attack as a bonus action on its turn. So I'm going to roll 8d6 for this attack. Damn. Let me ask you a question real quick. Stitches kind of looks over to <laughs> Nora and she's like, we're, we're safe here, honestly. I think this is a good call. I think that, you know honestly, how you can like spend position to like boost your two hit? You can't do that with like, I don't know, like AC or something, can no, you? No, no, you can't. Oh, cool, cool, cool. I'm I just sure can, but I'm I have not to make scared, it. but I can, I can boost my AC with position, but I have to make a successful melee hit to do it. Oh, well, yeah, Eric can because he's a cleric, but. Fuck. You're Stitches a, just, and I are just like you're arms telling me crossed. the deprived can't do this cool thing. Just, like watching, just a little like, guy. Like, ah. uh, okay, so I'm this crazy. this is this is definitely that Dark Souls moment where someone's like, "I can beat it! I can beat it! This, I can beat it!" And the nothing. the boss parries you, uh, and it this is it reduced to half. You take fifteen slashing damage. That wait, that's already that's already half. Yeah. Both of us? Oh no, just Zach. Okay. Okay, yeah, no, it's fine. Chill. <laughs> are, you, are you alive? Uh, hell yeah, I'm alive. And you just activated my trap card. I am now bloodied <laughs> as well. <laughs> How alive are you? And what do you Zach what do you looks up eyes I'm glowing red. Alive. <laughs> <laughs> Define alive. Uh, okay. <laughs> bloody, a little bit bloody. That's right, because you, know, you, you, you bloodied at like four. Yeah, and I healed Zach for three. Of one to 32. Let's say I'm a six on a scale from one to 32. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, well, let's... On a scale. <laughs> God. That's very funny. So, <laughs> since this is our first bloodied experience, huh, do, what, what was your origin that you picked? A brute. I'm a brute. The brute. Uh, so you wait, get a wait. plus three to your AC. Oh, and I have the preset bloodied ability. I was reading the wrong one. Okay, so what do I get? You get a plus three to your AC. Ooh. And you reduce all damage you take by two points. Okay, cool. You do fine. I don't know if this is going to make a difference because he is going to swing at you again. Uh, but what you, is your now? You roll a three. Now you roll a three. What is what is uh, what is your AC now? Nineteen. Nineteen. So you need a nine or lower on the dice. Well, that depends on Plus if I spend more position for that bonus oh, thing. Oh God! <laughs> and I can choose to do that after I roll, but I'm not sure if I will because he's a. Because He's not you're looking in, great. Uh, a kind and generous DM. No, not at all. He's just not looking <laughs> great. Ooh, okay. So that would be a 16 to hit. But I am going to spend the three positions <laughs> and five to do it. Damn it. Uh, so then I'm going to roll damage once more. Uh, you see this little guy. <laughs> Sorry, I have a shield, so that's actually a 20 to hit. You have to spend more position. <laughs> 16 plus 5 is 21. <gasps> oh, yeah, huh? 
Oh, yeah, huh? Math. Interesting. Interesting. <laughs> I'm glad we think, I'm glad we worked this out. But actually. remembering you have the shield is important. Yes. Yes. He can never hit me now. <laughs> the little guy says this out loud, and then all of you see him demolished by the sword as it swings down heavily. What? Okay. He did more than six? He did more than six damage? Oh, yes. It's wild. Yeah. It's wild. <laughs> uh, Hab, it would have been 18. Um, oh, Jack was a good right. guy. And oh, as a... Rolling on the... Not yet. Actually, uh, <laughs> you will. Though. I don't know how I pop back up, so... You, oh, you, they just have the rest of the bonfire as long as not everyone dies. Um, and as a bonus action, because it's bloodied, it's going to make a strike at Monty. Uh, Nah, I wouldn't even count if I spent position. Ooh, nope. Uh, it, it's a wide swing, and it goes right above your head, Monty. Um, and now, technically, is all three of yours turn. You can go in pretty much any order that you want to, since the three of you are considered slow. If one of you wants to go first, please feel free. Uh, discuss that amongst yourselves. Zach is dead. Ooh, that was that was rough. Um, you just oh, heard him go. Why? I'm really gonna miss Jack. Got, like, <clears throat> I'm gonna take my mace and two-handed <sighs> wallop this thing. Hell this yes. Uh, natural twenty. Hell oh, yes. So, Avenging the little guy. Yeah, I, gotta, I gotta avenge the little guy. So that's two d eight damage. You see uh, Meliora take out ooh. two little like opera house, little tiny binoculars. <laughs> uh, yeah. She's kind of watching. Seven damage. Nice. Uh, and then I'm gonna. Sp- yeah, I'm gonna spend the two position to bump my AC up That's by two. Fair. <laughs> Good move. All right. Who wants to go next, Meliora or Stitches? Um. Well, uh, age before beauty. Yeah. So go ahead. Go on then. <laughs> <laughs> go on then. Damn. You know, like I'm you sitting here, like, like in Mortal Kombat, like we're trading close <laughs> any time now. Uh, <laughs> You know what? Fine. I guess I will then. <laughs> yeah, I'll, you two, you two are like the the summon characters that like someone summons to help them, and then <laughs> they're just actually watching the person. They're fight just the watching. Boss. Yeah, I guess fine. I'll go ahead. Um, and his fist, lights of flame, is gonna throw another fireball and have to make a, a deck save. All right, that is a twelve. That makes it. So I believe you take half damage. Hell yes. Um, still would max, so four, four total. Beautiful, got it. Singes a little bit. Oh. Meliora. All right, that was formidable. Quite an attack there, Stitches. Um, okay. I'm gonna <laughs> cast a. Uh... Fuck it, I'm gonna do Soul Arrow again. Do 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 do. I cast this epic spell. I'm using the right dice. Hiya! Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> Is that four damage? I'm just gonna go on a limb. No, it's not even that. Oh really? <laughs> <laughs> How? Um, uh, I'll say it's two damage. But it's plus three. Plus three, right? It's plus three. Where? Yeah. What? It, says, it says that on Soul Oh Arrow. my God! It does say. Okay, yeah. So it is for. Yeah, no, no, yeah, yeah. No, I was reading the other thing. Yeah, no, it is for. <laughs> is it five? Like two plus three? No, I'm not spending any more position. I'm gonna be right here, nice and cozy. <laughs> Wait, am I? Am I math wrong? Are you guys gaslighting me? I don't know. What did you write? What's your, what? Yeah, what did you write on the die? One. Uh, oh, yes. So soul, soul arrow is. 1d6 plus 3 force damage. So it's a total of 4 force damage. Uh, For someone who was um, criticizing me, it seems like he did just as well. Yes. The ladies are fighting again! The ladies are fighting! The girls are fighting! (laughs) So that brings us to the top of the round. Well, the new top of the round. Yeah, don't don't you. Uh, And the silver knight is i don't get a second phase n- n- <laughs> your second you, you will you will <laughs> the silver knight this is a moment in dark souls where you can see that its health bar is almost nil it is almost defeated uh and it sees you monty 
and it kind of just starts swinging wildly. So, <sighs> my AC is currently 18. Nine, 10. Oh no. Uh, ooh. <laughs> okay, so here's what makes this interesting. And I'm gonna tell you about the board because this is basically the Dark Souls video game. Uh, I have four position left. I rolled an eight and I would need a total of 10 to hit Monty. So I would have to double my position. And I could do that by spending three position. And I'ma do it. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Fair. Uh so that will bring me to 18, which is then uh and I am going to have the damage for you again already. Monty, you are taking 15 points of slashing damage. And Monty has now been bisected in half. Oh my god. 15 and half. Ooh. No, fifteen okay. is the half. Um, it was it was okay. thirty one. This is this is oh. not this. So, <laughs> oh wait, you're. F Look at that. You just yeah. split in twain, didn't I? Didn't he? Honestly, really impressive. Um, wow. Definitely doesn't uh, skip uh, on arm day. Is he looking at like you that. or is he looking at me? Um, kind of you oh. just turn around. You definitely see like. Stitches behind, like just hiding behind you. <laughs> Definitely looking at you. Um, oh, God. and God. the Silver Knight switches to a great bow and then oh. moves 30 feet towards the two of you. Huh, what is it he? It is now your turn. What is he up to there? Um, he... I don't know. Do you want to try hitting him? Um, sure, sure. I yeah. can stand back. Yeah, I'm What's standing way mean? back. <laughs> <laughs> No um, I'll do. Uh, I'll just keep doing soul arrow. It's, see, I like the fact that it just hits. Oh, I'm that's right. Oh. Yeah, that you just killed him because he had one <laughs> position left. Oh! <laughs> yeah! Either either you'd have hit him with soul, or I would have done. You have to redo a deck save, and you have to be safe to at least take one oh, damage. Yeah. Oh my god! Well, I mean, if you're like really counting, like I did do, like crit on my dice, like <laughs> like how hard I six. <laughs> so like it I like fades it away. <gasps> hmm. See, there we are. Is that so hard? Where, where'd no. you go? Um I'm over here and you can turn around definitely <laughs> behind like a tree and like I'm here. I'm just chewing young from here. Uh-huh. Well is that oh. all you summoned me for? No, no. Uh if you want to, there's a dragon down there you can go and fight as well. A what? <laughs> uh, a dragon. I think it goes by the end of days or something like that. I don't know. Right. Oh. Good that news. One of its heads are missing. So like, it'll be a bit oh. easier for you. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So you, if you want to go down there, I can just like, I won't follow you, but I can tell you the directions if you want. No, I think, I think I'll save that one. Okay. Okay. For another time. Yeah. Perhaps. Um, <clears throat> so I don't know if you know this, but we've died before and we came back again. So I think oh. we have to kind of like rest up a bonfire and then the others will hopefully maybe come mm -hmm. back the last oh, time we had I... did it um um void looked slower if that makes sense a little bit not as quick on their feet as it used to be so there's probably something will happen when they arrive okay. but but your little friend ended up becoming like they seemed a little bit quick quicker witted oh. so i guess it affects people differently the whole dying thing that is very interesting. Yeah, yeah. I thought I'd just give you an update of what you. I'll have to missed. try that sometime. I don't know if I'd recommend it, but okay. Well, shall we? Yeah, you go ahead. I'll follow behind from a distance. Billy Aura just like backs up facing you. <laughs> the bonfire. <laughs> hey, last time I was at the bonfire, something came up with a sign on the ground. I'm just. <laughs> Making sure as many bodies between me and it as possible. Right. 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 And eventually, Stitches will come and sit by the fire as well. 
<laughs> so both of you rest, and the version of Meliora that is there disappears because this was simply just an NPC Meliora, and the yeah. real one appears. <laughs> I don't know her. With all the same memories. <laughs> oh, now that's so good. Zach and Monty. This is the second time that you'll have done this. Both of you roll a wisdom saving throw for me. DC 18. I failed it, but I fail it if I, I don't roll a 19. Well. <laughs> oh, God. All right. Who wants to go first? Are you sure 14 doesn't save? You're sure 14 doesn't save? I, look, the book made this one. I didn't do this. <laughs> <laughs> I'll roll first. You know, Hell yeah, please. 12. 12. Atrophy. Your oh. muscles are starting to fail you. Weakening. Reduce your strength score by one. Oh, oh no. no. Oh no. Oh, great. I'm pretty and I'm pretty sure that takes me from cuz that that's take me from a 12 to an 11 which I think takes me to a a 0 instead of a plus 1. <laughs> I am so sorry. Oh no. That's rough. Oh, no. Sometimes it is easier to just die and make a new character. Huh? <laughs> yeah. But you know, that's not what's happening right now. <laughs> <laughs> you can get really fucked up. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. EJ, please. Good thing if I'm going to roll a nat 20 right now. EJ's just going to get something good again. And then I'm good gonna thing I'm going to roll a nat 20 right now. Okay. I'm going to feel bad for okay. bullying Eric. Okay. Wasn't that 20? I got a seven. That's good, right? That's good, right? You are a member of the dead. You mm -hmm. carry the burden of the grave with you, and it scares those who look upon you. Gain plus mm -hmm. one whenever making any charisma intimidation checks. Nice. <laughs> nice. I'm a scary little guy. I don't know what to tell you. What your hubris fuck? is working too well in your favor, and I'm <laughs> going to humble the fuck out of you. I'm trying <laughs> so I'm hard. I'm like trying to like live that live that same energy and it's not working out for Monty. Monty, Monty shows up to help you, dies, yeah. and then gets not good bonuses. I love that Monty is the most genuine, just like good fella, you know, trying his best. I mean, Monty help. isn't a good person either. No, he gives the good no. person vibes, no, in my opinion, in Meliora's opinion. Maybe he's trying. <laughs> I don't think so though. All right. <laughs> So Zach is both, pure apart. You both are revived once more and find yourself surrounded by your two other companions oh, shit. sitting around the bonfire. Oh. Well, did you get it? You're creepy. I um, did. Did I successfully intimidate Stitches? <laughs> <laughs> you're, you make me uneasy. With passive um, intimidation. <laughs> But I'm glad you're back. Um, Boyd, you're not looking too hot. Are you good? Oh, thank you. Yeah. Can you, uh, I don't know, touch some more things next time? Maybe don't, may maybe stop. Maybe don't. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, that was on me. That was you know, on like, me. I, like, like, if you're going to run away from everything, maybe don't be in the first through things, you know? Yeah, or, no, that's, you know. that's fair. That's fair. Maybe walk um, with your hands in your pockets. Um, okay. I can hold your hand if you need me to. No. No. It's a lot harder for me to carry my mace around now. <laughs> I feel as though I will be significantly less good at hitting people with it. Dude, I'm so sorry about that. Um, I would offer well, you a we'll drink, just... but I only have like three SS flasks left on me. Um, I'll just push stitches to the front next time. Um, I won't be useful, honestly. You um, can be in the front right. with me. No. No. Ooh, actually. Nah, nah, keep talking. <laughs> you know, maybe I'll just do like a little perception check, make sure there's there's, uh, <laughs> there's, there's no mushroom men hanging out in the, in the tree line or anything. You just look around, you see a mush, the same mushroom men staring at you from behind the tree line. Yeah, I rolled a four, so. I'm sure there's nothing wrong. It's trying yeah, to do that eye fine. thing, but it doesn't have fingers. So <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Yeah, well, I think serious. Gabe joked about it being like it follows, where it just slowly follows us just throughout the whole. Like the know? snail? Yeah. <laughs> the immortal <laughs> snail. 
Uh, there was uh, when you defeated the creature, uh, Meliora and Stitches, it dropped a sword, Lothric's <gasps> holy sword. Oh my! Ooh. Um, do you want it or? I mean, I'll take I, it. I yeah, felt go, the beast. Go ahead. I should have okay. it. Okay, yeah. I, I asked you if you wanted it. And I do. Th then go ahead, please. I'd like to see Does that you in the mean front you're going to be in the front? Me? Yeah, you have a sword. You want to be in the I'm front? I'm not very effective in the front. Well, I, you know. Does the sword get longer? I know I was, you know, murdered <laughs> or whatever, but, you know, Zach, Zach was putting in work. I don't know. Honestly, that's guy. a good point. Yeah. You think you could? You think you'd be effective with it, Zach? How how big is the sword? It's it's like a long sword. Mhm, mm mhm, mm mhm. You see, Zach kind of grabs it. It's about a foot taller than than me. Um, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Swings it around wildly. Okay. Hey, hey. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Do you need it? You can have it. No, if you, need it. you know what? I You'll need be it more though. More effective with it. Take it. It's yours. Zach kind of, it looks like he's sheathing it on his back, but you can see he's not, he doesn't have a bag or anything. The sword just kind of. It's in the cave. Like, it's <laughs> unequipped. It's in my goop. <laughs> it is a 1d8 piercing blade. And you can spend three position after a successful attack to blind your enemy for one turn. Oh. One position to blind? Three position okay. to blind. Three position after a successful blind. attack. Okay, thank you. And I sent it in our chat as well, just so you have it. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. <laughs> <laughs> Good question. Uh, I, a thing I noticed in the book that I, probably, I wanted to talk, ask about, um, mm -hmm. obviously in like D&D, when you have a weapon, it does like a dice number of damage plus whatever modifier. Is that the case for any of these weapons here? Yes. So okay. with melee weapons, it will always be strength as normal. Okay. But if you can use dex for them instead, it'll say finesse in the same way that D&D &D does. Mm. Okay. Uh, and interestingly enough, the Lothric's Holy Sword that Zach is wielding is also a finesse weapon. The mace is not, which is why I now have, <laughs> which is now it's just a straight roll to hit. Oh, no. <laughs> I, uh, I can't imagine what a finesse mace would look like but i look like yeah or behave like and all of you hear what sounds like jingling bells mm -hmm. oh. and you see a strange figure with a <gasps> snail like shell on their back a long staff that has a bell at the end hobbling their way towards all of you and then they just sit next to you at oh. the bonfire uh, also, Meliora and Stitches, as survivors, you have claimed 700 souls Ooh. from the Silver Knight. Gamers. This figure who sits down looks around. Are you looking for anything? My shop is open for business. <gasps> oh my. Gabe, how much is it for me to level up? 900. I have enough. If you want. Yes. Okay. I'm going to do that. I'll just make it more difficult. Fuck. Um, <laughs> <laughs> let me see if it's worth it. Um, <laughs> do you have a hat? Yes. What sort of hat would you like? I didn't think I'd get this far. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what kind of hat I want. <laughs> Zach just wants something to put on their head. I'll give you a helmet. Ooh. One of the best kinds. <laughs> do you want something that protects you, or do you want something that just makes you feel good about yourself? The second one. <laughs> now, Zach, think about the things that we are encountering. The second one. <laughs> it's 20 souls, and they pull out what looks like a bucket. Will I be able to see if I wear the bucket? Will I be effectively blind? No. Um, do you want to be? <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. so uh, yeah, I can give him 20 souls for this dope-ass hat. <laughs> yeah. 
It will do you well. It previously held water of holy nature, but now it holds your I mind. I hiss when he puts it on my head. <laughs> oh, the holiness is all gone. Okay. Yes. And I hope no holes end up in your brain. Oh my. Anymore, at least. The rest of you, is there anything that you seek? Oh. Weapons, shields. Uh... I mean, I could do with a weapon. I have a hand axe, but it's not much. What do you seek then, child of cinder? Oh, I kind of like that. Um, <laughs> I would like... Do you have a, a crossbow by any chance or anything like that? Or or short crossbow. bow? Crossbow. Yeah. Yes. Gabe just has to find the page. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and also, do you like, by any chance, like do spells or is that just like no no okay oh Me magic is cast yeah yes. why would yeah, you ask it, such it, a thing it, clearly just, i you know, have I would, a test, test. light crossbow i can sell you i'm i'm down for that 600 souls yeah um here you go and that'll that'll come with 20 bolts oh okay Ooh. Uh, and I will put the stats for that in our chat as well, just to make it easy for you, Drek. Thank you. What about you? You look kind of sickly. Uh, Monty. Yeah, I've been taking a lot of hits lately. Uh, so mm -hmm. any sort of, I guess, a shield of some kind. Uh, let me see. Uh, you know, something that, you know, I don't mm -hmm. know. Something that's it's got that, that pretty useful. Something to protect Effective. your guts. Yeah. You have all these guts. You don't want them to fall out. Yeah. And they, all the medium-sized ones seem to be the same. <laughs> so <laughs> the, the amount of, you know, so that's that's nice that I can afford all the medium ones. <laughs> if you see one that you're interested in, just say the name and then you can have it since you've already pulled it up because you're looking through my inventory, making my job easier. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh, they they all have like they're they're all decent and they all got like one ability but there's a bunch of them <laughs> it's yes, a lot it's, to look through it's impossible you know i'll just go with i i'm you know I, you got anything that's like i don't know something like a, a sunlight shield or something like that yes i do it's 300 souls oh you know what never mind I can't carry that. <laughs> I, oh, no. I actually can't can't wield uh, many. Of, I have to do a small shield. I'll do it with the small shield. Oh, because of can, your strength. Yeah, because I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go oh, with like I don't sucks. know. Uh, you know, I just I guess I'll just do like a buckler, just like a buckler. Oh, no. <laughs> oh Monty. And hope that I don't Feel because. Like because with that, then it's got no strength limit, so I can I can wield a buckler pretty easily. Do you do you have a do you have a reaction that you use? Uh, no, I guess I don't need a buckler. What, what shield a do you use now? I don't have any shield right now. I'd I'd recommend the leather shield. Yeah. Okay. Uh, when using a leather shield, once per long rest, you can spend one position to make a bonus dash action. Yeah, I'll take that. That sounds cool. pretty useful. So that way you can run away when Zach leaves you to die. <laughs> but now Zach stays there. It's 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 stitches that left hey. me to die. That's hey, true. I got the to turn name Everlasting. You summoned a, a monster reason, and then left know? me to die. I was fighting with you, but away. You, you, know, you weren't. You weren't. I, I threw quite a few fireballs, okay? Did not see them. I saw Zach doing stuff. I did a lot of things. I often do things. Do you want anything weird, long-haired creature? I love that you knew. <laughs> hey, hey, weird one. They're talking to you. Like, <laughs> nudge money. Yeah, you're the only My other gosh. than the little guy. I don't think so. I think I'm. I don't have quite hair. well off as of right now, at least. Well. Should you have any odds and ends, perhaps? Like fingers. Ooh. Fingers. Sure. 
I'll take a mm. finger. One hundred souls. Ooh. What a steep price. Is it a special finger? Yes, it is. Uh, it's called the finger of degradation. Ooh. It's not in the book. You're not going to find it. Ooh. Yeah, I'll take that degrading finger. <laughs> Hell yeah. It just nags you. Um, <laughs> you, when you're in danger. This is gross. When you're in danger, consume the finger. It okay. will be useful. Oh, Some jujitsu kaijin Thanks. stuff. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, had, I had a friend called Itadori. He was all about eating fingers, you know? <laughs> Good. Good choices. And they stand up, and the shell shakes a little bit. And you hear, like, squeaking inside of the shell. Ah, time to go. And they hobble away into the distance. And you know, this... You Go this ahead. place is a is a everlasting nightmare. But some of them, some some of the people are all right. Yeah, yeah. Did you get his name? I didn't. Oh, no. dang! I forgot. Next the, time. I forgot the next time. You can call him. He had bells. Bell face. Bell guy. Bell guy. Yeah, I'll I'll, I'll probably remember the snail the, bell. Bell the snail. snail with the bells who sells mm -hmm, things. Mm -hmm. Looking down the path the figure came, you see what looks to be a cobblestone road that turns to the left around a bend. And you okay. feel that presence that was calling to you before down the pathway once more. Oh yeah, uh, another update thing that you went around for. And um, we kind of been f just following a feeling around. Um, the last one led us to this bonfire, so it's following you to the other one. Ah, um, has yeah. this feeling proven useful? No. I think we I nearly died every time. I see. Yeah, I've died twice. Well, we died, but it seems to have been a good thing so far. It didn't. It sound. It is as bad as the last, as the first time I died. And... I think I have a bit more of an edge, and I try to intimidate. I don't know. I, I try to intimidate everyone. Just be intimidated. It just, it just backs away. Like Jesus Christ! I'm going to run. Fuck. Um, I like this way. I like these dice, man. I don't know what to tell you. It's the it's dice just, that May got me. Thank you, May. You just do that, <laughs> like the Tim Burton, your eyes come out of your head and you go, ah. Yeah. <laughs> I go, I don't know. I think I'm a bit more scary now, huh? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, oh, my. oh, my God. Jesus. Don't swing that sword so far. <laughs> hey, uh, scary little one. You wanna, do you want to take point and go ahead and we'll like, Mm -hmm. I drop them. into a track starting position. Oh. And uh, go. I didn't mean that. Okay. Um, I just meant I like start going down point, the path. But um, I follow suit. <laughs> so you follow the path for a bit, and you do see beautiful scenery with a starry sky above you. And as you go further and further, a mist starts to settle in. You start to see what look to be bits of ruins, small buildings that have been broken down. And eventually you find what looks to be a stone wall that extends beyond the eye can see, seemingly a castle. And you find yourself up to a doorway that's been broken in and it goes downwards, down a door dark slant that about 50 feet down flattens out and goes forward. Is it like a, a yeah. slide or is it like a staircase going down? Uh, more like it's, it's like more like a staircase. It's not so okay. steep as you would slip. Okay. I mean, this is where the feeling is taking yeah. us. Um, and it's always led to death. Um, it's so I just keep following it. Right. It's cool. Uh, I would like then. everyone to make a perception check for me. We should probably be checking for traps. We got. Yeah, that's a good point. We probably should. That yeah. Way. What's wrong with my perception? That's another four. Three. <laughs> perception. Uh, thirty twenty. Okay. Now. <laughs> hmm. 
I need everyone to roll initiative. Oh, fuck. Holy shit. <laughs> Technically, it's like that moment in Skyrim where you just are walking on your own little way, and then suddenly it's like, you're like... <laughs> I wrote a you, 19. You have to like rotate your character 360 to see the like the see red dot in the compass, literally see where the compass has the red dot. <laughs> I rolled a three, getting very feast or famine tonight. 16. What did Monty get? 22. Ooh, okay. I will not be shamed again. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm going to roll my position dice. Hint, hint, everybody. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Roll your position dice, everyone. Doing that currently. Oh, All right. Fuck. Not great. Not bad. <laughs> not great on my end dice. Ah. Bad. Okay. Very sorry for how this is going to go. Ah! Um, you are, and none of you notice it, sadly. As you are walking down this slant, uh, stitches, stitches, you hear a click, but you oh. don't know from where as you're all walking down this slant. And... <laughs> no. You hear then behind you yep. and oh. a an enormous sphere of stone starts to roll so stop it stitches, <laughs> uh, stitches what did you get for initiative 30 20 uh oh, wait no i think it was an, i think that 20 was the perception 19 yeah. for um initiative okay and then miliara what did you get 16. Uh, and then, Zach, what did you get? I got three. Three. Okay. Uh, so, Stitches and Monty, you do go before this thing, so you would be able to double move fast enough down and out of the way. Okay. Uh, Meliora yeah. and Zach... I need you to make a dexterity saving throw. I can do that. I can do that. As on its turn, it moves 60 feet in a straight line. Oh. Great. Fuck. Seven. <laughs> Seven, so, best. I think Seven. Stitches. <laughs> oh, no. Seven. The moment just Stitches hits the click, Stitches just <laughs> runs. Like, for, just, just yeah. starts running without any words. No explanation he just runs yeah and as soon as and as soon as i see guy. stitches start to move i f instinctually am just like i have to keep up with stitches yep. <laughs> so this and boulder, Zach are just in a conversation with each other <laughs> this boulder starts gunning it down oh. uh starts rolling speeding 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 zach and Meliora, you're having a bit of a conversation. You hear this boulder at this point and turn around, and it is like 10 feet from you. You turn back over your shoulder, and Stitches and Monty are already maybe 10, 15 feet from the flat level where there is like a doorway that they run through. And you take 58 bludgeoning damage. <laughs> I'm looking for a way to have this. <laughs> That's why I'm silent. I'm looking. I mean, if you've it got a way. It doesn't even matter. It doesn't even matter if I uh, did have a way that is all of all of it. Yeah, yeah. That was yeah, the, uh... yeah. Hey, you is can that... increase uh, saving throws by position, can you? By spending position? I think there's abilities for that, actually. Oh, well, certainly not. Not yeah, you. I mean, I you have. you can't right now, <laughs> but there are abilities for that in this book. Well, that's when you're yeah. deprived. Uh, so yeah, <laughs> you take 58 points of bludgeoning damage as this boulder barrels down and basically demolishes the two of you. Okay. Now, Monty and Stitches, you make your way down and through. You hear this barrel slam behind you. And as you run through this door, 
you see a long, narrow hallway that then turns right. And when it turns right, you see a minor glow. Oh, um, we're going to miss them. Um, we probably should find a bonfire. Um, guessing, hopefully. I'm going to try and stealth forward towards this glow, but deliberately stealth. Uh, let's see, plus three to stealth. I'm not terrible at it. Um, so add that plus three to this uh, natural one. Oh, no. <laughs> that, it's like, uh, awesome. Can this? Actually, no, it can't be. It's just two of us. I, I rolled stuff as well. I rolled a dirty 20. <laughs> awesome. And so you're just going to move forward? So, no. I'm after that fiasco. I'm gonna look around for any traps. <laughs> Make an investigation check. <laughs> yeah. I'm uh, assuming I'm super sneaky, and I'm just gonna sneak my way forward and oh just boy. trust that I'm not gonna step on anything because <laughs> I'm being Monty. so careful right now. I wrote a I wrote a nat twenty, so twenty one for investigation. Uh you do see what looks to be a pressurized spot on the ground can i grab monty before <laughs> before they make any moves or is it too late roll initiative and if okay. you can if you can beat monty's initiative then yes <laughs> um i got a nine i guess it, it wasn't meant to be um <laughs> <laughs> i rolled a nat one oh uh, my God. for two <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> this is rough that is a trap that is all too familiar to you two as from the other side of the hallway darts shoot out oh my um that is a 21 to hit stitches oh it hit oh fuck okay yeah that hits that is a 12 to hit Monty. Misses, I got a shield now. <laughs> <laughs> I sneak it forward, shield forward. That's why I'm not being very stealthy, is because I'm going shield forward. <laughs> so Stitches takes three piercing damage, and I need uh... you to make a constitution saving throw for me, Stitches. Is it three, right? Yes. Okay. Okay, and a con save? Yes. That is a... Are you still wearing your priest robe or your prayer robes? Fuck, I am. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it didn't change it too much. So that's a 22. Ah, so that is a pet. What? I hate you. <laughs> yeah, I wrote a nat 20 the first time and I wrote a 19 oh. a second. Uh. <laughs> uh, so then you take nine points of poison damage. <sighs> wow, guess how many, how much I had left. Don't even say it. I had nine left. Ah! <laughs> Welcome to our club. Welcome to our club. <laughs> Damn it. I reach out like, Monty, no. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I think I'm just slowly walking forward, not like just focus on trying to not make noise. <laughs> so I maybe don't even hear it. Because <laughs> I'm playing. nearly. I rolled almost max on my my position die, so I'm still, I'm like as healthy as I've ever been. <laughs> I planned this. We love out. that for you. Uh, we I planned love out this encounter you. very minutely, uh, and who, <laughs> because of your terrible stealth roll, as you walk up and move around that corner. A strange little imp-like creature tries to stab you in your leg as soon as you walk around the corner. God. I hate those things. It's just the Spider-Man meme with me and this little imp. <laughs> that is a 19 to hit. That does hit. That is... Three you points. Your oh, no, you can't. I'm done. Of yeah. piercing damage. And I need you to make... A con save for me. You wearing those us, sick, you, nasty you, robes? Yeah. <laughs> Why would you? Of course, he gave us these robes. Uh, so, 
The lower of the two is 12. Uh, that will pass. So Ooh. you take four points of poison damage. Okay. For a healthy boy, I'm sure that's nothing. Uh, and then let's let's roll initiative again, real fast. Well, you roll initiative. This yeah. has, <laughs> initiative. I got excited. Uh, has it. Eleven. Uh, that will beat it in an eight. Okay. So you see this tiny little like stone like imp creature in front of you with a dagger oh. in its hand, kind of just yeah. Yeah. Piece of shit, yeah. and I'm gonna fucking hit it with a with uh with my uh, thing. Uh, 18 to hit. Yep. Okay, uh, that's only gonna be. I I have to do one handed now because I've got a shield. Uh, yeah. so five damage. Yeah, you kill it. You get ten souls. It yeah, was, it just it stabbed me. I'm like, ah, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> it was bet. It was betting on that poison damage. Yeah. And after you kill it, you do see about 20 feet ahead of you, a bonfire. Yay. Hey, guys, I, I found the... <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm going to go to that bonfire. <laughs> so you make your way to the bonfire. This is why... Okay, this is one of the things that I really just want to say. This is why I fucking love the Dark Souls RPG. Because, like, I love the idea that only one person has to make it. But, mm -hmm. like... If, if you give a bunch of small, very challenging checkpoints along the way, even if you die, sometimes it's like, oh, but now I'm now I'm rooting for him. Now I'm rooting for him. <laughs> like, and if, if they it. don't make it, then everyone knows what that process is going to be again. Like this, yeah. this is like the, it's nice to have a tabletop system designed so that repetition is intentional. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Especially as a DM. Because then I'm like, oh, everybody died. Now I get to run that again and I don't have to do nothing. Yeah. <laughs> you, and you can do things like have, like, you walk through the door and are immediately stabbed. It's like, ah, oh, fuck. How was I supposed to know? It's like, yeah, but it's Dark Souls. I can just yeah. come back the next. I know that. And now like, yeah. I know it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, so Monty does successfully make it to the bonfire Yay. and you get a rest again. I need everyone. To make a DC 18 wisdom saving throw, it's not Monty. And I would I want to just say this was not on purpose, but I do feel really glad that he doesn't have to make it this time. <laughs> yeah. I just like really a high. 17. I so. got an 11. I got an eight. God, I love this game. <laughs> I got an eight. All right. So you know what, Bravo? You haven't had to roll on this yet. No, so I haven't. Go ahead and just roll a d20 for me, please. Okay. It's not going to be a nat one. It's not going to be a nat one. Why would you oh, will that no. into existence? Why would you no, I'm that manifesting that it's not going to. No one dies today. Don't lie. Oh, no. 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 <laughs> Why would you will that into existence? <laughs> No! You're joking! <laughs> Take me instead. Take my little guy. <laughs> keep, keep Melior. You can have my little guy. EJ? I'm gonna throw rocks through your fucking window. <laughs> <laughs> I, I was doing the opposite Someone's of Someone's not gonna get to swim in the pool. Oh no! no. <laughs> Please! I'm so excited to meet Meliora's twin sister, M M Meliara, next week. <laughs> That's, oh, a, that's, that's a that's a nat one. one baby. Oh no! So for those of you who don't know what happens if you roll a nat one on the respawning, empty. There is nothing left of you to be consumed. You, whatever that means, is gone now. Damn. You are a mindless thing. You must create a new character. Rest in peace. Princess Diana. I <laughs> love getting to the end of the game. Rest in peace, love. This was your first time actually playing this character. <laughs> and that was Meliora's first dude. death. The Dark oh. Souls role-playing game is seemingly kind of brutal. And it is very important that you make sure everything is okay. Bravo, I want to actively check in now. Are you... Relative. Oh, okay. I'm 
I'm so good right now. Okay. This is fucking awesome. I <laughs> love that this happened. <laughs> we and we like this. This is one of the things where we talked about this above board. We made sure that yeah. everyone was fine with this being on the chart. But this is a circumstance of why, hey, maybe you can die over and over and over again in the Dark Souls RPG, but it doesn't mean you'll be coming back as the same person next time. Gonna go on Pinterest real quick, and <laughs> So here's the fun thing. Uh huh. We have two more roles. Mm hmm. <laughs> Monty makes it all the way there, sits by the fire, <laughs> waits for his friends, and no one else shows up. <laughs> <laughs> we all roll ones and just new people well, show no, up. No, like, Monty, the they all show up. But none of them, none of them opening their eyes and they yeah. sit there silently. <laughs> I didn't know the sorceress that well, so I don't know that it's, it's just like, <laughs> it was, uh, yeah, yeah, um, like magic's your thing. Okay. So go ahead. Could you okay, address? Maybe this is like EJ's manifestation coming in late. I would have not 20. Oh my yeah. God. <laughs> <laughs> Miracle of the Grave. Perhaps you are less than you once were, but this time upon, upon returning to life, you feel alive. Gain plus two to any single attribute. Oh, okay. Which means that EJ is going to roll a 10 or 11, somewhere directly in between. <laughs> so go ahead and roll, EJ. I think I'm going to get a nat 20 as well, I'm pretty sure. Okay, that's a 15. Not as exciting, I suppose. Oh, this is hilarious. Tom, you are too funny. Oh, no. Murmur, you have returned, but something has lodged in your mind from beyond. A voice is in your head now, whispering strange thoughts. And I think it's Meliora. <gasps> oh! I love that. It should have been you. <laughs> It should have been you. I I'm made hitting you. the bucket on my head. <laughs> <laughs> no. I made you to protect me. I had you made so that I would live a long time, so that my mind would be bold and held true. But instead, instead, my mind suffered because of you. Just a little guy. <laughs> Not even that. A little nut. You are nothing but a little burden. But Zach is like shrieking and like laughing and crying at the same time. And like just like pounding the bucket on their head. Stitches wake so like <laughs> Oh I actually feel better than before. Mm. So in, in this moment, to keep the role-playing going and to give Bravo a little bit of <laughs> <laughs> reprieve, another, you see a summoning symbol once more. So just instinctually, I'm going to just put my hand on Stitches' shoulder and like hold hey, him down from sit standing I, up. I've learned my lesson. I've learned and it, my is lesson. A gold, it is a gold sigil. I say hey, I know someone a companion. I know uh, my maybe. my opinion well, doesn't mean anything, only. but I will say the last time I used the golden one, it was good. But again, obviously, I mean, I made a mistake the first time, so you don't have to take my word for it. What do you think? How about you do it over there and stay there, huh? If it's so um, good. No, I'm I'm good. I you know what? I'm fine with just. No, you're right. It. You're right. It's probably no, good. Go I, do it. Oh, fuck. Okay. Um. He kind of pulls out his light, his light crossbow, um, and like, I guess like, touch, like activates a summon sigil and like, just turns around to back away, but it sees Monty there and goes, "Okay, yeah, I'll, I'll stay here." So the figure that appears is named the Sorceress of the Shade. So for all intents and purposes, Bravo, we're still going to have you be using the character sheet that you have from sure, Meliora sure. Uh, as a summon to help these companions it also Ooh. means that your death is well you won't have to roll on this chart that if you died again 
Uh, it is a boon that you can hold on to for the rest of this session and is a way to make it so that if you're playing the Dark Souls role-playing game and you are streaming or something that makes it hard to just stop the game to have someone make a whole new character, this is a way that you can keep it going in a different way. But now also maybe it'll scare my other three into having an extra character sheet just in case. Nothing bad would ever happen to the little guy. Yeah, um, Stitches has a brother called Rags. I really thought you were going to say... Mm -hmm. <laughs> I did no, too. please tell me what you thought I was going to yeah. say, because it's probably smarter than what I gave up with. It wasn't, nope. it wasn't. Damn it. I knew because yep. I was Eric. the same thing. <laughs> yep. Hi, I'm Stitches, and this is my twin. It was oh. The name we were thinking of was alliterative. Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Yes. I'll think about it. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely. All right. So you are you now realize the area you're in is more of an aqueduct. And now you can hear water in the distance. It looks like the pathway goes forward a bit more and it is uh, dimly lit by lanterns on the side. And you can see a little bit of flowing water in the far distance of the hallway that's going at a parallel direction. I'm like pointing my crossbow at this summoning and seeing that nothing's attacked me yet. I turn to Monty. See, it's good. It's good. Okay, why don't you hang out with it? Uh, okay. Um, hey. Oh, since you're like the best friend, you know, the summoning. Friend, I... uh, yeah. Okay. Um, hey, buddy. How you doing? Um... Bravo. Do you do any <laughs> uh, Dark Souls esque emotes? <laughs> <laughs> I go. I did the little bow. Oh, oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Um, do you too? Do you do you that? <laughs> uh, I'm I'm holding my hand. Up. I point. <laughs> <laughs> uh, wait, I, what's what are you point at? Um, hi, I'm Stitches, and you're here to protect me and them, but mainly me. Oh, okay. You remind me of someone I knew, like, maybe 10 minutes ago. <laughs> okay. I didn't know we're allowed to, was that email even allowed in the game? Is that, are we, are we allowing that? <laughs> it's a mod. I modded, I modded this one. <laughs> <laughs> Ew, giant leeches. Don't say oh. that. Oh my god, what? This is perfect! Giant uh, leeches. <laughs> no, not, not leeches. Oh, I'm gonna... I wanna... I'll be re right back. Um, I'm gonna get my... my souls. Yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> I'm just gonna head back and avoid the trap, the pressure plate. It's... it's... It's already been sprung. Yeah. Okay. I'm still going to avoid it, just in case, and take my souls. There was a trap? <laughs> <laughs> yes, there, I was going to tell you, but then I got hit by it after you triggered oh, it. Oh, yeah, um, I put my shield in front of my face, and I walked forward, and I felt wind pass me, but I didn't see. Yeah, yeah no, <laughs> it hit me. Um, but I'll, if I can, I would like to collect my soul. <laughs> you can. I'll allow it. Okay. I'm benevolent. Thank you <laughs> for now. But oh, understand at a moment's notice that can change. <laughs> Anyways. Not the giant leeches. <laughs> oh no, I found something way worse. It has the word sewer in it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that was really funny. <laughs> Yeah, it was it was a joke. <laughs> um, ooh, actually, little guy, you do me a favor. Will you yeah. roll a perception check for me. Certainly will. I'll take the bucket off my head for this one too. That's uh, what do I add? Seventeen. Hell yeah! You Hell yeah. looking down the distant hallway, you see something scary past very quickly. Looks like this. Bad, oh, evil, terrible. terrible, awful. Yeah. I, no, not, not I didn't like that. it. I kind of 
tug on Monty's prayer robes. Are you wearing the prayer robes? <laughs> yes, yeah, I am. Tug on the prayer robes. <laughs> I, there is something over there. Okay, I guess. With a lot yeah. of legs, and I never had, I never seen that many legs before. Yeah. Right. Well, I'll either kill it or die trying. I guess. I don't know. Do I, I don't have. Keep going this way. Ah, uh, I don't. I don't know. I we're just kind of going. Yeah. Uh, I don't know a lot. I look things. around for another way. Can I look around for another way? Make a perception check or an attack roll. Wait. Okay. Oh, looking for oh, hidden yeah. passages. Okay. Yeah. Uh, attack roll. That'll be a sixteen. You swing at a wall, and it's a wall, and nothing happens. I think we have to go Unless. kill the legs. <laughs> yeah, we all yeah. know you have to hit it 30 times. Gotta hit a couple times. <laughs> I hit it again. That's, hey, that's Elden Ring. Dark Souls lady, you do it in one. Yeah, 19 to real. hit. Cool. Does hit it, it work harder. this time? No. Hey, hey, Zach, Zach. Sometimes the message you find on the floor just lies. You know. Oh my God, do you guys want messages on the floor? Please. I'm going to see Tom for that. <laughs> I would find that very funny. All right. I'd like to read Trifinger Butthole at least once <laughs> what, in the game. Then I'm going to roll a d20 to determine for me if they're good messages or bad messages. Oh, okay. Try in jumping. Front of the summoning sign is just, is this dog? Could this <laughs> be dog? <laughs> uh, there is a message that says, try using fire in, uh, as you start heading down the pathway, like towards where the weird thing was. You have so much fire. Oh, you have so me. much fire. Oh, yes. yeah, yeah. That's my whole kind of thing right now, apparently. Um, you first. Me? Oh. <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> Polite is, is um, shield and hand axe. I guess I'm going first. Um, and there is another message that says stealth works. Cool. I'm going to crash <laughs> Look down. Look at Monty this time. You are so quiet. <laughs> you are so good at stealth. Oh, I crash yeah. down and Not bad at it. Um, and I'd like to do a perception check, please, to look for traps. In this hallway? Yeah. That's an investigation check. Investigation, that's it. Oh, I think no, that might I'll be actually my, better. I'll take my bucket off my head for this one as well. 17. Oh, wait, should I just... If I help him, can you just get advantage? Yeah, I can do that. Roll with advantage, yeah, then. let's do that. 18. You do not find Ooh. any traps in this hallway. I... Don't think there are traps, but I could be wrong. So I guess tread carefully. Oh and God! <laughs> I'm gonna, as stealthily as I can, start heading down down the hallway. Monty. Yes. What's your class? Cleric. Good to know. Thank you. Why do you just say Eric? <laughs> you right? I'm like, <laughs> I didn't know who was talking just then. I didn't know who was talking just then. Uh so the four of you start making your way to well, actually, is it just stitches? Are y'all letting stitches go by himself? I'm following behind. Okay. I'm behind stitches. Oh, can I get in my bucket and have the summon carry me? <laughs> I mean, I guess that's this is just a to, flavor question. This is not mechanic. Bravo. Just be a little... <laughs> Bravo, you just gonna carry this little guy? In a bucket. I'm in a bucket as a handle. It's easy to carry. Yeah, what well, can I? I mean, I'm like a little shady spirit. Yeah, sure, whatever. They can interact with the world. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna yes. carry and world. then I'm gonna do like the centrifugal force thing and like <laughs> Sweet Oh my oh, god. god. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like flattened in the back of the bucket. <laughs> Turn Zach into goo. How big do you think this bucket is? <laughs> How big do you think I am? <laughs> Zach's just a little guy. <laughs> you know what? Yeah. I've, never, right. I've never visually described my character. I, I don't think any of us bit... have, honestly. Oh you kind of did. It was weird. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what? You, I, yeah, you, you sent us a picture of a mucinous, mucinex, uh, mucinex uh, mascot. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That, that's kind of what I'm going for. Yeah, kind of dig it. I have also, a just, question, like, Gabe. Little imp. Yes, please. Am I coming in as a level two character? Yes, you are. Thank you. Game. Maybe She's more. Ready. Maybe more if they live 
this next encounter. Yeah, Jesus. Um, so you all. Here's my question. Do you want harder challenges for more souls for better chances to level up? Because we technically have two more sessions. Yes. So I, yeah. I yeah. want to give you the chance That's to opt in. Yeah. My yeah. vote harder. Yeah. All right. Awesome. You. Uh... <laughs> uh, you make your way uh, into where this like, flowing water is. And you see what looks to be definitely an aqueduct flowing both directions. When it goes right, it looks like it goes over an edge and drops down. And the left path just seems like it goes for a far distance. And at the very end of it, about 200, 300 feet down, you see it goes upwards next to a staircase. Hey, I'm all, all good with being like the meat shield. Because, you know, it's fair. I kind of run away at other times. But I'm going to definitely leave the like, decision making to that direction I'm going up to you. Because all of it feels bad to me. Uh, you see Zach pulls a coin out of his um, prayer robes, I suppose. Um, and I'm going to flip a coin for this. If that's cool. <laughs> <laughs> Please. Okay. I didn't label them before I flipped the coin. <laughs> Amazing. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, okay. One for the... The options are the stairs and the what? Uh, or It's basically up or down. A up waterfall. Down. Okay. Oh, so... I didn't oh, think so y'all were going to go over there. I, I mean, you can, sure. <laughs> I think, no, no, I think, Zach, I think we take the stairs. You know? I, I'll, I'll, put some, I'll put something over there, I guess, if you want. Hey, I don't know. Every, whenever I've encountered a waterfall, we have stairs. to check behind it. So I did not roll the waterfall, just in case you were wondering. So Zach kind of leaves it up to the up to the coins. It goes, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, and points to the stairs. So you, you see the, the stairs waterfall. in the distance. Um <laughs> And you notice when you're standing in this aqueduct area, there is a sense of like wind blowing past you with like uh, high walls and ceilings, uh, creating almost like a wide area where you stand on this not so narrow, but relatively narrow walkway, like 15 feet across, 15 feet wide, excuse me, next to the flowing water. I suppose we should be looking for traps as we move along. Y yes. Um, I'm looking for whatever it, hit. this scuttly thing you saw. I, I Make a perception it. check, yes. So many legs. Perception. I'm bad at those. I'll help uh, you with that. I'll, I'm I'll looking help? around. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Roll with advantage, Monte. Okay. Then that's a 14. Hey. I'm so glad you looked. Because as no. you all start walking, no one considered looking up. I, uh, I knew you were going to yeah. say that. And above you, Monty, you see scuttling slowly following you with its hands suctioning on the ceiling. And this thing is massive. This thing is maybe 15 feet long. And as soon as you notice it, we're going to roll initiative once uh -oh. more. Okay. Evil, evil. Ah, I don't have to roll. That's weird. I rolled its initiative DC anyways. I have apple pie and I've loved it. Oh, what is that's, that's, that's a twenty? Yeah, it's a twenty on an initiative again. Ha! I wrote a nineteen. Okay. Ah, I, I got as well. I got a Damn. seven. Okay. Oh, no. uh, everyone <laughs> goes just flabbergasted. First. And I'm like, oh, yeah, of course they got one of those too. Everyone <laughs> goes before Monty as this thing drops down next to all of you. Oh, fuck. Landing in the water. So it is within melee range if you would like it to be. But you also do have a bit of space. Ooh. Everyone roll your in, uh, position die. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Got it. Max. Not Fuck bad. Yeah. Ooh, not bad. Uh... They're learning, chat. They're <laughs> learning. Because this one's going to suck. I picked this creature entirely by name. 
Oh. Oh. Okay. Yeah. yeah, the abilities in this, I, I read through like a decent amount of them when I was working on it. I didn't read through all of them. Some of these are fucked. <laughs> oh God. Oh. Great. I mean, it wouldn't be Dark Souls unless we walked into a room and, and fought something that we just were not capable of fighting. Yeah. Honestly, yeah. Yeah. We're really close to a bonfire. That's fine. Oh, damn it. I just got you souls. That's the idea. <laughs> uh, so, yeah. Oh, so, uh, Zach, Stitches, and Magic <laughs> Meliora. <laughs> Hell yeah. Uh, what would you like right. to do? I don't know. Uh, get fucking hit with my club. <laughs> you have this a... thing drops down. Oh, I have a sword. I'm going to hit yeah, with my you sword. Got a sword. Yeah, now. yeah, yeah. Hey, 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 don't worry. I'm good at the game. I'm good at the game. That's 19 to hit. Uh, that will hit. Oh yes, I'm I'm not rolling a one d four anymore. <laughs> oh, that was really good. Okay, that is seven damage. All right. And then I am going to action surge, and I'm going oh. to hit it again. Are you going to spend three position? Don't forget you have that ability. With the sword. I, I will be doing that immediately after this action surge. Okay, that is uh, 23 to hit. Yes, I love how you knew that you were going to hit. So that's, you're like, oh, I'm going to do it after the action surge because I know I'm going to hit. <laughs> it's called manifesting. <laughs> okay, and that's another five damage. <laughs> All right. <laughs> that's another five damage. And then I'm going to spend three position and I'm going to let out, I'm going to unleash a war cry. Uh, in which you have to make a wisdom save. So Zach just fucking stabs it twice with the sword and then goes, yeah! and that's it. Uh, that's a 10. Ooh, uh, get stunned for a turn. Get stunned for a turn. Get stunned oh. for a turn, loser. Get stunned for a turn. <laughs> that's why you weren't smart enough to do it first. Shut up. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> um, how long see, have you had that the whole time and i didn't realize before we started today <laughs> hey. um, it's your turn yeah seeing that seems like that was a good job because i'm gonna need it to stay still for this um and i'm gonna cast combustion and um, where so my whole arm kind of lights up in flames and i'm gonna swing a punch at it um, and it has to make a deck save, but it's stunned. So I think it automatically fails. Yes, it does. Um, and I'm going to spend three position to bump up the damage by one more d6. This is going to be 4d6 fire damage. I kid you not, I rolled three sixes on a five. <gasps> yes. Huge. 23 points of the fire dice damage. Gods are on Huge. You do one nice thing for them, and they decide <laughs> that it's going to be um, make, make an intelligence check. Just a straight intelligence check, intelligence. Stitches. Okay. Oh, I'm going to just plus one. Um, a 10. That's enough. Fuck it. Uh, you can tell that that message for Try Fire was true, because it looks like it distinctly wounded this creature more than something else might have normally. Oh, perfect. Um, I know you said I should be in the front line, but I'm gonna back away a bit. Is that, is that cool, Monty? I'm gonna just back the stay feet. I'm gonna like slowly backward, step backwards, <laughs> stay feet from this thing. <laughs> so pissed. <laughs> I'm so pissed. Y'all <laughs> fucked my thing up so bad. <laughs> You're locked in here with us. Basically. <laughs> God. All right, Bravo. It's your turn. Um. Yeah. You already know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do a cheeky little uh soul arrow. Like no big deal. Yep. Um. No big deal. Oh my god. I do like nine damage to him. Great. Wow. Uh, awesome. <laughs> actually, also because I'm like super dead and like nothing matters. Um. I'm gonna. <laughs> 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 you seem to be upset with our mastery of the system <laughs> that we are that we are in fact learning to play. No, I'm I'm so glad. I'm so happy. 
I'm gonna spend four position and add um two extra damage. So that's nine, ten, eleven damage. Great, awesome. It's great. It's my turn. turn. It's your turn, Eric. <laughs> no, isn't it the thing's turn? No, it's stunned. Oh, oh okay. yeah. <laughs> okay, then uh, I guess um, <laughs> nobody looks like my mouse died. <laughs> no. <laughs> nobody looks like they need. Healing. I did too much damage. It went through the computer and into Gabe's mouse. <laughs> you did too much damage. I guess I'll just hit it with my mace. <laughs> Roll with advantage. Okay. Thank Sorry, you. that sounded aggressive. Roll with advantage. <laughs> ten. With advantage? Yeah, I rolled a ten oh. and a four. Eric, just 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 do me a favor. All right. Uh spend enough position. Is it what? It was one position to increase it? Yeah, one position mm -hmm. per increase. Yeah. Okay. What do I need to spend? Spend five. Yeah, I'll spend five. That's that's nothing at all. Yeah, just just do that for me. Yeah, I'll spend five and then do uh, four damage to it. Four? Yeah. Like F O U R? Correct. Dope. It's just a D6. No, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> I have four position left. <laughs> I want y'all to know y'all did 75 position worth of damage to this thing in one turn. <laughs> I'm like kind of confused. So I thought we like asked for like hard. Word? Talking, please. <laughs> Word? Hey, I'm not with EJ. I'm not with nah, EJ. Hold on, hold I on. don't know that. I've never met EJ. I've never met that never person. Met EJ? In my life. Did you say we AJ? I don't, I've never met them before. Five points of position in one turn. EJ's not with this adventuring party. Like... Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, I did hold up, improv hold up. with a guy named AJ once. Uh, I don't know. Is that who you're talking about? AJ? AJ? So, nope. <laughs> EJ will listen to resistance, and we still have like 15 minutes. So, uh, we can do it. We can do it because I finally read the character sheet that I was given, and <laughs> I can do cooler things than I thought I could. <laughs> you know what? You guys should try reading your character Fuck sheet. It. I, it actually helped me a lot. <laughs> Another one rises out of the water. Fuck. <laughs> Let's do this shit. Your turn, EJ. Be and if you live, the payout is going to be wild. Because that one had 3,900 souls that you just claimed out of it. So let's go. Let's go. Okay. Let's go again. Your turn. Okay, 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 okay. We're okay, farming, okay. We're farming um, the bugs. That is a 19 to hit. That hits. Okay. And that is seven damage. And <laughs> go ahead and make that uh, make that wisdom save for me, please. 17. Rolled it already. Yeah. You knew it was coming. <laughs> No, that's fine. How much damage was it? It, uh, it was irrelevant, so I didn't pay attention the first time. Sorry. Seven? Got it. Seven. <laughs> seven. Um, Bet. Oh, I can't action surge this time. Hey, that's fine. Don't nope. No, you can't. <laughs> no, you can't. Yeah, I don't even need to. Okay. Take it Go away. ahead, Bravo. Take it away, guys. <laughs> Is it Bravo's turn? I don't know. Trust. I don't know. Just I just can't see my arrow. Like, just be like a really good, like, fun person. Okay, a uh, two plus three, that's five. And yes, Stella, they are bullying me, so I'm bullying. <laughs> I would I never nice. ever do that. I tried to be nice. I'm the one who died. The gloves are off. Mm -hmm. Five damage, <laughs> five damage. Yes, got it. Yes, <laughs> yes. All right, EJ, I'm coming day. for you. I hope you know that. It's not that it, it promises nothing personal, but I'm it's personal. <laughs> <laughs> Bet. Um, Drac, it's your turn. Yeah. So this other one that appeared is it in melee range of me, or am I safe? Uh it's it's where it's where the other one was. So you're relative. Okay. Well, you're don't say safe, but you are far away from it. Okay, perfect. 
Uh, oh, but wait, you got fire. You're also a problem. Okay. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, cool, 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 cool. Um, I'm going to run up to this one. The one that's just appeared in front of me. Mm-hmm. And I'm going to use combustion again. Okay. Um, it needs to make a, uh, a deck save. Okay. I'm, the way it's worded, I have to make an attack first. And if it's successful, then they roll. Yes. Save. Okay. Um, that's, that's a nat 20 to hit with my... Um... <laughs> <laughs> But Denied. I think that only applies to the weapon damage, right? Not the fire damage. I don't give a shit. Go ahead. <laughs> you don't get to make that choice. I do. I'm okay. God. Yes, Dracodus. Whatever. Go ahead. I'm God. <laughs> Go ahead and roll double damage. Mm. Okay. So for the for the melee damage, I rolled a one for one of them, so it's not great. Six. Um. No. Seven slashing damage, and then I have to make a deck save. It, it rolled a nine. It did not pass. Oh, okay. What well, I'm going to spend, um, um, I think it's like for every three I spend, I can add another D6. So I'm going to spend six to add two D6. Um, so, okay. That's fucked up. <laughs> All right. Twenty six points of fire damage. <laughs> How's it um, hey Gabe, how you doing? It's bloody. It's not great. It's not. It's not doing great. Um, and what? One of I was gonna die. I'm just gonna let you and, know. Um, I'm. I would take the opportunity to attack. I'm running. <laughs> I'm running away. You running? Okay. Yeah. Because it does have reach. That is. A 17 to hit? Yeah, that hits. So it is biting you as you run off. So you take five points of piercing damage, make okay. a constitution saving throw, and you have disadvantage. I need to get out of these the goddamn ropes. ropes. Fuck. Is it an action to take the ropes off? Yes. No, um, you need to do it when you're resting. You can't just be like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, I rolled a dirty 20 with a disadvantage. Uh, okay, so then you will take half damage. I rolled a nat 20 on one of them. Well, Hell yeah. don't mean diddle to me. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you take 15 points of poison damage. Oh, shit. Um, so the thing about that... <laughs> no! I had, no! I had 14 left. Uh, oh, <laughs> that's what you get for spending on that position. I didn't think I'd do with that much damage. <laughs> How we learn? Because y'all didn't get hit the first time. Um, yeah, so I immediately go down. Um, that's cool. <laughs> it, yeah, you like punched it and started to run away. It grabbed you and like shook you like a dog. Yeah, it did that, that, that whole like sequence where like shakes you, throws you up, and then catches you again. Yeah. All right. Well, <laughs> so now it's the creature's turn. Mm. Uh, and it wait, it's bloody, so it can do a lot of stuff. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's messed up. I'm not gonna do that. Um, <laughs> uh, so it's going to take a bite attack at you, Zach. I'm sure you'll be fine, buddy. Just go by. That is a 16. No. Shield. <laughs> mm. Second bite attack. Oh. That was the only 22. No. Well, that, <laughs> one, that one hits a little. Uh, to make a con save for me. Disadvantage. Can't take, can't take the ropes off. <laughs> nope. <laughs> nope. This is my gift and my curse to all of you. That's a one, isn't it? Hell yeah. No, no, it's a 12. That oh. makes it, right? Does it actually make it? <laughs> DC 13! <No. laughs> I can't spend that 
cool position. <laughs> you don't have that ability. It's really cool position. Okay, cool. Okay, that's fine. So you take 26 points of poison damage. <laughs> okay, okay. And Are you still up? Fuck. <laughs> you people are. Okay. This is why I love the Dark Souls RPG. And I, I feel vindicated. When the creature becomes bloodied, it immediately takes a leap attack. The creature leaps up to 15 feet towards a hostile creature, and then one creature within five feet of it must immediately make a DC 13 deck saving throw. Okay. Make a deck save, EJ. DC 13? DC yep. 13. That's a 14. Okay, well, I add... That's a 16. On oh, a I successful save, the target suffers 18. half damage and is not knocked prone or poisoned. So by half damage, you mean like, like how long? Like, like half? Like a little <laughs> amount? Oh, no, it's not little. It's not little. Like a little amount, like a little amount of damage? Uh, 14 points of damage. Mm. Mm-hmm. And it definitely does that damage? Yes. Cool, 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 cool. So that's about 13 more than it needed. (laughs) (laughs) Uh, Eric, it is your turn. Cool. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. Um, Yeah, I guess... um, I guess I'll... (laughs) I'll hit it with a mace. Because <laughs> my, my things are hit things with maces or heal or have it. Mm. This thing is probably pretty dexterous, so I probably can't push it away with force, and it's got reach anyways. So I'll just try and hit it with a mace. Uh, it will an eight hit. No. Okay. Yeah. So I swing and I miss. Eric, how. How, do you... how much how much health do you want in this? How much help do you want to be given? Uh what do you mean? Uh, like, do you the, it it looks bloodied. It looks yes. Yeah. It so, looks bad. I guess I will What do you think of Bravo? Do I still have my finger? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I hate that question. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Just to know. Weird. Okay, well, you know, actually, you know what? You don't have to do anything, probably, Eric. Uh, Because do we, do we have any, like, what it, when? No, so you I... don't. You're dead. I'm taking it away from you. Okay. Not, not you. <laughs> I'm in Bravo. Me? My finger! Dad. Well, uh. Bravo, it would be your turn. What do you do? Yeah, I know what I'm about to do, baby. It dies. I'm actually very upset about it. It had three position left. That's right. That's and that's how you do it. So dumb. I knew we could do I've it. Been the, <laughs> I knew I've we could do it, guys. Pulling my weight today, and I'm fully dead. Eric, I want you to know. <laughs> I don't we're gonna have to figure out how to do this off camera because since Eric's the only one who lived technically, Eric just gained 7,800 souls. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna be so fucking strong after this, man. Fuck, yeah. Okay, so that 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 leaves me with a cool seven thousand nine hundred and sixty souls. <laughs> you guys realize this means we are all just NPCs in the <laughs> yeah. main character storyline that is Monty. Like, but, yeah, Monty. Like Monty finishes the fight, sees mostly everyone's dead again, and goes. Am I the chosen one? <laughs> <laughs> this does keep it it's does the main character. It, it's, it, it ends up that like the others do a lot of damage and then they get targeted and then Monty like survives out of happenstance. So before before we wrap up, because it's already been like almost two hours. Exactly. Damn. Uh, <laughs> Stitches and yeah. Zach. Yeah. Real quick, just roll a DC 18 wisdom saving throw for me. How about we make it less than 18? Yeah. How you can about make like, it more. How about 11? How about we can like bump it down to 11 maybe? How about a That'd 2? Cool. I think there are rules for actually Because a 2 is it. what I roll. I rolled an 11. <laughs> so you know what? 
EJ, you roll first for me this time. You've had a great lucky streak. Okay. Fun. Not 20, not 20, not 20. Mm. Six. Six? Did I already roll a six? I might have already. No way. Is it not a, not a good God. One. It can't Swear be. To God. <laughs> <laughs> Do I look Im scarier again? Immune. <laughs> No! What? Death has <laughs> cleansed you of some of the frailties of human life. You are immune to poison and to the poison <laughs> effect. <sighs> cool. Thank you. Okay, well, Thank what you. am I going to get? And that's how I've been killing you all lately. <laughs> Thanks. You I kid you not. Like a lot of I more wrote a six. I wrote a six. <laughs> <laughs> I wrote it. <laughs> you two died to poison, and now you're and we're like to never it. again. Wait, are we mean permanently, or is never it just again. until we die next? Permanently. Yeah. I'm having fun. Yeah. This is a fun game. Okay. <laughs> I'm having. So, I'm not even kidding you. I'm literally not even kidding you. I'm having so much fun. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> I mean, you could still kill old Monty. <laughs> he's, he's just no, kinda... I'm rooting. I'm I feel rooting bad for Monty, for Monty when I'm Monty dies. If Monty, Monty dies this game through our next two episodes of Monty dies, I'm rioting. I want Monty to live through. <laughs> if I have to throw all of my characters away for Monty to live, I'm going to Monty has that cheeky, like, 8K gold right now, or 8K souls. Yeah, Monty's he's, he's coming up in doing the world. great. He's going to get those cool, like, Montgomery Gator sunglasses, huh? <laughs> <laughs> I cannot believe. <laughs> well, I can stitch his wake up and like, I feel for some reason I feel like I can take on one of the spiders thing again and just actually like do better this time. Would you want to? Gonna go into <laughs> no, I mean they're they're, they're straight up gone. You killed them oh. both, but yeah, you punched them both real good. They did not like that. Oh yeah, um, you took you got all the souls, didn't you? Well, I mean, you know, uh, I didn't die, but, you know. So maybe just like stop dying. That's what I realized hey, that that's been I a big that's been a big issue for me is is, is death. Uh, so I stopped doing it. You know I'm gonna I'll I will try that out and maybe go well, back you know to what? what I was originally Actually, doing. Actually, uh, stitches, stitches, and Zach. Oh, no. We're gonna hold off on this because we we would assume Monty would go back to the bonfire to bring his companions. It's true, back. I haven't gone to a bonfire. Yet. <laughs> yeah. Dude, would you would you say that that you would do that, Monty? Like hold off going on to the bonfire? To, no. Would like, you go back to the bonfire? That I don't know. From? Like, I guess. Would you would you go back or would you go forward? Does actually? it seem there doesn't seem to be like one like within range? It's it's such a risk to go ahead. I think I might go back. Because there's like, I don't think I can do this by myself. <laughs> <laughs> so if Monty goes that. back, if Monty's goes back, then the rest of you would come to once more. And Monty would have all of the souls. But next time we play Zach and Stitches, you actually will have a chance to regain some of those. Because you were alive when the first one died. It just means oh, you'll have yeah. to reclaim oh. your souls once more and, and kill before, two more of them yeah, and kill two more and those two more will be blocking your souls and you so if you die again you'll lose your souls forever and my new mm. epic character will be here yeah yeah Yay! so I'm i hope to meet them. everyone watching learned a little bit more of how to play this game i hope you got a little bit more insight on how it works the boons and banes of the respawn chart, the hollowing chart. Which I love that chart. Damn it all. <laughs> I love that chart. Loves chart. you, apparently. <laughs> but this has been an absolutely delightful, very strange, very satisfying time. And I think as we start doing a wrap up, we're going to do a drawing for the winner of the collector's edition of the Dark Souls role playing game. <laughs> Yeah. So right off the bat, I'm going to go with you, uh, Bravo. Please uh, tell everyone where they can find you. Hi, guys. 
guys. You can find me um, on Twitter and Instagram as Brava with five R's. Uh, B-R-R-R-R-R-A-V-O. Um, I have my entire backlog of art that I've drawn ever there. You can look at on top of that. Um, I uh, run a cheeky little channel called The Money Hall with EJ and my friend Nikki. Um, and uh, we also have a backlog of all of our um, stuff that we put up on YouTube. Um, recently, we did the Chaos and Cardinal one shot and the two uh, highlight reels that came out from the birthday stream. So those are out now. Um, you can find me on Fridays over at Stella Luna's channel uh, playing some cheeky uh, Unbound Uncaged Anthology. And yeah. Hell yes. And then Drac. Please. Hi, I'm Draconix or Drac. Uh, you can find me on Twitter at Draconix, that's D R A K O N I Q E S. Um, <clears throat> kind of stream all over the place. Um, so, honestly, following me on Twitter is probably the best place to find me. But the next thing that I have in the pipeline is on Friday um, at 6 p.m. Pacific over on Q Times. I'm in an all villain campaign called Parliament of Owls. On Wednesdays, I'm over at Rule of Law in, at 6 p.m. Pacific as well um, in a service system campaign called Infinite Horizon. Um, Thursdays, I'm here at 6 p.m. Pacific, um, playing Stitches uh, in this Dark Souls teacher for you to learn to play. Um, and at, once every month, I think third the third Sunday of every month, you can hear my voice in actual play podcast called Sea Pride RPG. Amazing. And that's everything. Oh, also, I'm one of the sc scenario writers of Damus Academy, and I think it's still on Kickstarter. We funded, but if you want to back it, probably like a couple of days left. So jump on it. It's good. Oh, yes. And congratulations to Adventures of Tony for winning our giveaway. Uh, I hope you come up with some absolutely terrifying scenarios. <laughs> so then, EJ, please. Hi, everyone. I'm EJ. I'm That's One Big Egg in chat, and I'm several big eggs on Twitter. Good name, no matter what Gabe says. Um, and you can find me here Thursdays, you can find me on Stella Luna's channel on Fridays for uh, Unbound, a game with a lot of uh, muscular lesbians and tomfoolery and whatnot. Um, and you can also find me sometimes on the Monty Hall, which is Cassie's uh, channel baby. Uh, yeah, thank you. Oh, yes. And then Eric. Hi, you can find me mostly Eric on most of the things on the internet, because uh, it's usually my name in those places. And uh, Sundays at 7.30 uh, p.m. Pacific Standard Time, you can find me on twitch.tv slash BNB Tabletop for the Board and Barrel, which is a board game show where we play a bunch of board games with my buddies. Oh, yes. And yes, please come back next week and then make sure you come back for our finale in two weeks we will be doing another giveaway and it'll be well i'm not going to be as nice as i was this time i've okay. learned from my mistakes i can i can level straight up to level four not quite not in five yet but almost <laughs> that's oh my god <laughs> terrifying and yeah. they're gonna need it Monty, my name is Lord gabe i have been your dreadlord today now that I know they can handle two challenge rating eight creatures. Did we handle it though? I don't know if that really counts. I think, we did a great it. Job. I think the only reason why we handle it is because you do fire damage. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You do fire Quite damage literal, yeah. and the little guy can apparently stun. So you I'm know very what? glad I Honestly, saw ben, that. that was a great combo. That was great. <laughs> I'd really love to introduce you to Vort of the Boreal Valley. Oh, I Ew. really would have. Oh my god, if we get to fight Vort, I'm gonna scream! <laughs> <laughs> Screams anyway. <laughs> I want to fight Vort so bad. Okay, well. Fuck. I guess I get to bully them next week. I will see you all next week. <laughs> Thanks for watching.